Yo, what is up guys? It's Bankrupt Dope, back with another video. And today we are back on Reverse 1999. Before we even get started, I just want to say I am thankful for everybody that watches my videos. I just need to go ahead and throw it out there right now. Thank you guys for subbing. Thank you guys for liking. Thank you guys for watching. Sometimes I know my viewership fluctuates. It sucks. I wish it was more consistent. But like, regardless to what, I'm thankful for everybody that watches. If you happen to be here, you're not subbed, but you find yourself watching my videos, please hit the subscribe button. It helps your boy. I really do would love to be able to create content on gotcha games and stuff like that full time. But unfortunately, I can't because I don't have the means to. But I just wanted to get out that way. But before we even get started, I hope you're having a good day today. And if you're not having a good day, I hope your day gets better. You are another drill. Now this is cool. I just loaded in. I've never seen her inside the, this thing. Like, that that's interesting. I didn't realize that she could get put in there. So that's kind of cool. But we are about to talk about the theft of the Remy Cup really fast, guys. I have to say that in total, overall, this is a phenomenal starting event, y'all. Guys, there were just so many resources that you could get. As you can see, I haven't even finished getting all of this yet. Guys, do you... There is so... And we still have 12 days, guys. There are so many resources in here. It is insane. And if we take it over to the new part, right? We're just looking at... Um, sorry. We're looking at the market, right? First off, you can get a skin. So once you complete this, I'm pretty sure you... At some point... I'm not sure if we... we I'm pretty sure we can get an overabundance of resources. I just haven't got to the end yet. But we can get a skin for Appleton. Cool. We get this, the crystal casket, which gives us one of these. The house, any one that you might need, you can pick it up. That's great. Fortune's only one, but you have the kale right here, or the nail right there. So you probably won't need to pick up the, the nails the first one, isn't it? Nope, actually it's not in here. Oh, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. So yeah, so you get the nail, plus whatever's in the crystal casket, which is great. Fortunately, it's only one. It'd be nice if it was more than one, but we got the other one in the other part, I think, right? I'm pretty sure we did. Let's just check. I don't want to. I don't want to spew false information out here. Did we get one over here? No, we did not get one over here. We just got the nails. Is what we got. But either way, I'll take the one that they do give us on the other side. It helps. And then you got the Tome of Mineral Wealth. So this is for mineral characters. You can buy those. That's probably the last thing I'll get. Enlightenment. You need that. You want to get all the general materials that you'll need. And a heavy duty one. So you want to start off on top. Obviously, this is not so much a necessity. This is something that you can get at the end. Unless you really think you're going to need that skin. Save this for last. Go ahead and grab this first. Then that. Then this. Maybe not that actually. Get these out the way right here. All of these. Get all your little essential materials that you might need. Work your way down to these, the Sharpenty and the um, Sharpadanti and the Dust. Leave the Wilderness Shell for the end. Grab all your level up materials. Leave these for last as well. Grab these after you've grabbed all the big ticket items. Once you grab those, then you can work your way down to these and everything. Grab your Sharpadanti and your, your Wilderness Shells and your Dust. Once you get all that, then you go ahead and grab this. This should be the last thing you're grabbing, in my opinion, because it does not improve your gameplay at all. So you don't need to grab it last. But either way, we have 12 days to go ahead and claim all of this. And guys, I have that. This is about 115,000 dust, and that's 75,000 Sharpadanti, and I didn't catch it. And then you can just go off on 10 to grab 10 and 10 and 10 and 10 and 10. So like right now, I can get 12,600 Sharpadanti directly if I wanted to. Actually, no. Because it's. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, you get 12,600, so it's one for one. But that's really for the end. Once you start doing that. So, great rewards there. You have this right here. This is like another little puzzle where you got the missing. Honestly, just go on YouTube and figure out. If you can't figure out any financial stuff, just go ahead and hop on YouTube. But the rewards are here. You get a, a decent amount of clear drops. And you get some sharper Dante. And you get some dust. And you get a couple of... The Swell of Fortune, what is this actually for? Yeah, Insight and Figured. And then this is for your um, Side Cubes to level those up. And it's just a whole bunch of that. Some upgrade materials. You get these up in there, which are very good. 
a, just a decent amount of rewards all throughout here. We'll take it. Free rewards. I love it. And then you have this thing down, down here. More rewards. You can see. You got um, clear drops. You got essential materials. You got dust. You got sharper on Oh, down here. Not as much, but it's here. You just complete little tasks. So like for here, interact with characters once. I have to do that for my daily and challenge. Log in for five days. Put my hand to sell your activity. That's just stamina. Create any three materials. Clear normal analysis and defeat 100 with the enemy. Things that can be done quite easily. I can clear them right now if I wanted to. I just haven't. I'm not in a rush. But a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of rewards. And I personally believe overall, maybe not the character. I think that you can get this character if you really want to, in my opinion. You don't need to go pick up this character. I don't even think you need to pick up Melania. I think there are other characters that you can just build on your account of the free summons, I'm sure. Including four stars. That you can just build a team. Because if you scratch out Melania, right? Now, granted, we did put Ana Elite on that banner. But, like, you scratch her out. I feel like you could probably build a very, very decent team off of four stars. Good day, my but I'll be fair. You're too kind visiting me. I, I summoned a lot more than others, so you might not have as many five and four stars maxed out as I do. So I, I, I you do have to set that in account, but I feel like you could probably still make a banger team with four and five stars and then throw a couple six stars on there as well and really go crazy. But overall, the theft of the Remit Cup. This is it, it's gonna quick video. I believe this is a great event. It's a great start event, and I really hope that they keep up with this kind of like you know resources in terms of money wise there's a lot of money they gave us keep giving us that money the only thing i ask right inside three materials i'm not good at dealing with visitors we need more inside three materials yes there were a the few that were in there but it still comes to the point where crafting is going to still take forever just unfortunately crafting still takes a lot and yes, they gave us some materials, but my, like I said, my only ask is boost the boost this. Either let us get a stage to grind these directly, or give us more of them more often. So yes, I appreciate all the shop around here. I appreciate all the dust because that lets me get my characters up. But the insight three, like like you just get stuck there for a lot of people because it's so expensive and energy consuming to get there. So if I had to choose any problem with that it's that it didn't give us enough insight three material yes they gave us some yes they gave us some like, obviously i do I, I will say that everything that they gave us was good it was a good event great event but if i had to choose something that i would want more of to make the event full circle is that period period just that just give us more insight three materials on hand so that we can awaken more characters but i feel like they're going to be characters you're just not going to be able to use because the material farm is irritating it takes a long time and you just it's just not realistic to get a whole bunch of characters leveled up when you're trying to get the resonance upgraded or you know what i meant when i say resonance I'm talking about this it takes a lot when you're trying to get this upgraded as well as insight it just takes a lot so please keep this trend with how they did the sharp bounty and dust and just other materials please keep that trend going please 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 and just up it a little bit more for the anti-3 that's my only gripe the only thing i can say i repeat it too many times done saying it. thank you guys for watching if you watch i appreciate y'all let me more see interact. Meets, more opportunities more ghosts more possibilities thank you guys for watching drop back on the video if you like to comment something down below let me know how you're doing with the event let me know if, let me know what team drop let me know what who's your favorite character in this game that's what I want everybody to do. If you're watching this, let me know your favorite character. I really want to know. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.